Hi and welcome back to my second video. My name is Martin and I'm from SK2 Computers. Okay, this is a follow on from my previous uh, video on what is bloatware. Uh, as I explained last time, bloatware is any software or trials or demonstrations of software that become pre installed with any, particularly any new PC or laptop computer. Uh, these programs are installed by the manufacturers just to try and get tempt you into trying them and buying them. If you buy them, then they get a bit, piece of the pie, a bit of commission. So most of this stuff is unneeded, unnecessary, and what we want to do is just get rid of it all to give you a nice, fresh machine, you know, and get the performance that you've actually paid for. I showed you a few different methods of removing the software last time on my last video, but this time I want to concentrate on one of my favorite pieces of software out there, very handy to have as a, as a PC repair uh, consultant. The piece of software is actually called the Crappifier. And uh, what we can do, I've already gone to the website for this piece of software, Decrapifier. As it says, the PC Decrapifier wipes unwanted junk. So it's just a piece of software dedicated to removing unnecessary software trials and demonstrations from your computer. You can find this at PCDecrapifier.com. Okay, so what I'm going to do is just run you through just an example of this now, because if we have a look at my desktop, I, this is a demonstration machine, so you can see I have some demos on here of games, uh, stuff that I don't want. So, so I've got Chrome, let's download the Crappifier. Okay, it's only a very small program, so it downloads relatively quickly. Okay, and then we just run through the installation, just as normal. Uh, we're not going to check for updates because we literally just downloaded the latest version from our website. We click next, next to the license. Uh, once again, read for any warning messages. One great thing about this software is you can say that yes or no, that this is a brand new computer. Depending on what you select here, the program sort of optimizes it for, for finding, you know, uh, different software. Uh, I'm going to say yes, this is a brand new computer. Uh, I would recommend at this point to create a restore point. This, as it says here, creating a restore point may allow you to recover from unforeseen errors. Because everyone's done it, you accidentally delete a program that you use. What do you do? Hopefully you can restore it. So it's always double, you know, best to, to double check yourself and uh, create a restore point. So I'm not going to do this because I know what I want to uninstall. So I'm just going to continue next in the next step. Okay, so it gives you a list of all of the programs that are installed on my computer at the moment. So I'm going to go down this list and just select the ones that I want to remove. What I would recommend, if you don't recognize any of these names down here, don't remove it because you could inadvertently uninstall something that could affect, it won't break the computer, but you could uninstall, say, your, your graphics card driver, so then the display wouldn't correctly display the image and you'd have to go through and re-download the driver. So if you're not sure, either go and investigate it or don't delete it or ask a professional. So I'm going, just going to remove some demonstrations, some trials of game software on here. I think that should do, yep. Yeah. So once you've selected everything that you want to remove, click on next. Just prompt you. And then what it does is just go through each product now, uninstalling it. You will get multiple prompts just asking you to OK each program to be uninstalled. But uh, this is, this is it just has to go through this uh, stage. Uh, it would be the same if you're doing each program manually one by one. But this just go uninstalls them automatically one after the other. So you don't, it just removes that manual step. So we just keep going through, and uh, as I said, these videos sort of time with the post that I put on my website, which is uh, www.sk2computers.co.uk. Uh, I do a, a post, you know, every few weeks of a different topic. So if you've got any suggestions, please drop me a note on there. And I'll go through that. Once you, once the software has gone through and re removed everything, it will come up with a removal complete screen. 
Uh, you can put any comments in here if you want to, you know, feedback to the developers. I'm just going to click on finish. And that is done. If we go and have a look at our desktop now, those pieces of software are done. Now, that would have saved us five or ten minutes from doing it manually. So, I mean, that was only removing three pieces of software. If you have got a new laptop and you've got 20 pieces of software, you can imagine the amount of time saved. And now your computer's uh, performance is where it should have been when you first bought it. So, uh, thank you for uh, joining me on this. Thank you.